Hello, my friends. I was thinking about guilt and how some people have had jobs that would really compound the guilt in their lives. And um, the ego that runs people's lives, that's its job, to compound guilt so that there's no escape, so that you think there's no escape, there's no release. And so you're stuck there forever. And you should just live it out, you know. <laughs> and that's tragedy, right? And there's an answer. I've been telling you there's an answer. And realizing that guilt is the cause of sickness is a big one. And that all healing is released from the past. You know, um, I'm doing a song on the accordion by Billy Idol. Start again, White Wedding. It's a cool song. And we can always start again. You know what? You, whether you've been a bombardier, you've, you know, bombed Nagasaki and Hiroshima, or else, you know, you flew your planes into the World Trade Center. You know what? By calling these people murderers and stuff like that, you know, I'm not seeing them as murderers. I'm seeing their essence as a Christ in everybody. Everybody. Every Muslim, every Catholic, the essence of Christ is in them, or the essence of God, our source, is in everybody. It's in the center of us. It's been layered over by clouds. So we really don't allow that light to come forth so we can hear that voice, you know, and uh, people that have had these jobs in pornography and women that have spent their lives and years in pornography, you know, compound of guilt and they just, you know, have chalked it up, you know, conscience may be seared or whatever, but no, 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 uh, you're innocent, you're innocent. Albert Einstein said it a hundred years ago that time and space are an illusion. See, the past, we think that we did this in this row, and I'm talking, and this word is coming forth, and this word is next. And, you know, linear time is an illusion. Time doesn't run like that. Time and space are illusions. See, so there really is no past, you know. And when you realize these things, you really want to be the best that you can be. You want to be every, all that you can be, you know. At, to, and to realize that you are free from sin, guilt, and fear. You know, uh, I'm still working through these things. They take a while. It's a process. I'm a messenger who's going through the process of getting free of all these things. And it's happening. I'm seeing it. I can get pretty bold. I don't mean to sound arrogant. Sometimes I think I sound arrogant. But, you know what, it's not arrogance, it's just letting you know that I'm really seeing this thing, it's happening. You know what, and, you know, I had a message ten years ago that's different from this totally. This is totally off the wall, and yet I'm seeing results, results, time and time again. And it also makes me angry, this course. You know what, there's a thousand ways to climb that mountain. A Course in Miracles is one way. It's my way. And, uh, but there's a life to live too, but I haven't really been able to live it. You know, getting hit with the sickness and stuff like that. But I intend to start. You know, I see, I see light. And I see uh, a way to tell people that you can overcome all these things with mindfulness and quietness. I'm talking about cancer, everything, High blood pressure, um, you know, everything. You can, we have a cure. We have a cure. And more than that, that's just one benefit of all this. So anyway, you people who have in the past had all these things compounded, guilt, 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 getting you married people that, realize your marriage is based on guilt and you stay clear of each other and if somebody says something the, the other person gets angry so that there's, there's that wall there and you can't attack me and you know totally not the to not the true love it's the love hate love hate 
and you know we want to come to a place of the love just the, just the love and that's where forgiveness comes in and that's releasing the past all healing comes by releasing the past you know the memories are okay but they fade out and these recent memories that are real important as we said before they fade out too okay right now releasing the past continuously leads to a cure are awesome. Need you.